Hello and welcome to the calculator guide video on converting between decimal and binary on a Casio ClassWiz. We're going to use the ClassWiz to help us to answer these questions. So we need to convert the following decimal numbers to binary and we've got 12 and 65. And then we need to convert the following binary numbers to decimal and we have 11101 and then for part D 110110. Press menu and we're going to use option three, base N mode, for us to be able to do this. And you can see highlighted in blue here, above these four buttons, we have decimal and binary. We also have hexadecimal and octal. We're not going to be using those in this video, just decimal and binary. And upon entering the mode there, you can see that it's set to receive decimal numbers. So that's going to be useful for us to start off because we're going to input the first decimal number, which is 12. Press equals so that it becomes your answer. And then we just need to press this button here. Under normal circumstances would be the log to any base button. But in base N, this is referring to binary. So if we press this then our number will be converted to binary. And it does display all the bits for us uh, that the ClassWiz is capable of, but we really want to just zoom in here on the last digits there, 1100. So we can express that as 1100 in binary. Now, because our next input is going to be a decimal number, we're going to input 65. We need to just press decimal again and then input our next number, which is 65 and equals to make that the solution. And once again, press binary and it shows more bits than we need. But if we focus in on what we need, we can give it a seven bits, one zero 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 one in binary. Okay, so as we're already in binary, that's going to be perfectly set up for us to do the next bit, part C and D, uh, because we're going to input some binary numbers. So let's start with part C. So it's 11101, press equals to make that the answer, and you can see it's put it into the usual format for the class was there. And then just press decimal to change that to the decimal equivalent. And you can see here that that would be 29 in decimal. Let's try that one more time with the last figure. So binary again, because we're going to do a binary input and it's 110110, press equals and then decimal to convert. And we can see that in decimal, that is going to be the number 54. So there we go, relatively straightforward for us to be able to use the Casio ClassWiz to convert between decimal and binary. But that's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you next time on The Calculator Guide.